standings. After the short program, the Canadians, then the Americans, followed by the Russians, two American teams, the Hartzels and Handy and Hunt in sixth and seventh place. Now, as we said, this kicks off the Grand Prix of figure skating, a series of six high-profile competitions over the next six weeks all across the globe. Skaters can compete up to three times in the series. Two of those appearances count in the standings. Then the top six in each discipline advance to the Grand Prix Final in Kishner, Ontario, Canada. We'll have prime time coverage of that beginning on December 15th. So we're set to go here with the pairs free skate. Gold medal about to be decided and on the ice first from the U.S., Danielle and Steve Hartzell in sixth place after the short program. Music from the motion picture Broken Arrow. They've had a whole series of injuries and difficulties over the past years following their national championship win in 1999. They're a very powerful couple, opening with a split triple twist. They have good speed through this program. This throw triple loop. Look at the power in that. I mean, that was a strong one. She zipped through that and landed in the best of solid edges. This is a very good beginning for them. And now going for the side-by-side -side triple toe, double toe. You could see the turnover on his leg as that happened. The foot just turned over way onto the side. It's like using a pole vault and having it lean to the side when you thrust it into the ground. That's a bad position on the layback. Danielle and Steve, the brother-sister team from Westland, Michigan. Been together on the ice since 87. You mentioned the national championship in 99. They followed that up with a top 10 finish at the world championships. But then the broken kneecap suffered by Danielle. They were out for much of that next year. Last year at the national championships in practice. Remember, Steve hit his head on the ice. Was carried off. Taken to a hospital. Received stitches. They did compete, but only able to capture the bronze medal. But they came out and won the short program after that accident. They were just an amazing story. By the way, this free skate, four and a half minutes long, which can be an eternity at this altitude. We're better than 6,000 feet up. And now again, these side-by-side -side triple toe loops, which they only did doubles. did a double. Heart attack lift. It's a 
backward press lift, meaning that she did not lift herself off the ice. He pressed her into the air. Back inside death spiral. Well, not one of their best performances. No, but you know, there was nice strength and nice speed and good security with it, even though there were some major, major mistakes. But there was quality in, the, uh, in, the, in some of the skating. Good reception from this audience here in the World Arena for the team that won the Junior World title back in 1997 in the U.S. National Championship in 99, Danielle and Steve Hartzell. And the throw triple loop here, this back outside edge takeoff, nice lift, good landing, very strong. And here are their side-by-side -side triple toes, double toe combination. And she goes up into this takeoff, a little off in the timing. She does a double and he does the triple, but then falls. And then she continues on to do the double toe. And this is their heart attack lift, this back press lift. It's a very unusual position. A little dangerous because they, he could catch an edge and that could be a disaster. There's a look at the panel of judges. Often there are nine, but here there are seven. Dick, what about the requirements in the free skate? Well, the requirements are less specific than in the short program, but they do include one or two pair spins, one or two side-by-side -side jumps, one or two death spirals, and, of course, as always, musical expression. Alongside the choreographer, Alan Schramm, Two sets of marks, as always. The first for technical merit here in the free skate. 5.1 up to 5.3. And they're very evenly spaced. I mean, there's not much division among the judges there. Second set is for presentation. 5.0 to 5.2. Again, And that's exactly the same. And perhaps even a little less. Their presentation is does not have much lightness about it. It needs to, you know, pick up the delicacy and the... Uh, flight that skating is all about.